So I went to um, college in North Carolina and got my degree in English literature and realized that it wasn't going to be my heart's desire. But I knew I wanted to do something creative, but I really didn't know enough about what was possible out in the world. So I think that notion of wanting to do something and not knowing what it is, is really all these years later is still exactly how I work. You know, so that the studio experience is that feeling when I go in the room of, let's see, I really, I don't know how I want to get somewhere. How do I start? And the only way to start is like one step at a time. There's just this point of giving yourself permission to work with what makes your heart beat. And that doesn't mean that it formal issues of um, abstraction don't come into my work. They certainly do. But I'm always looking for um, my material to be a vehicle for color. And that's my orientation. And it, allowing myself to do that was, was the biggest step in my art life. In a very lowly way, I have friends, relatives, the super in my building, everybody collects recycling. Everything that I use all day long goes into a bag. And I'll take that whole box and dump it on the floor and cut everything up until it's, until it's really abstract. And what I figured out that I needed to do is to work on a scale of about two to three feet so that I make individual collages. And because the way I've been isolating the color, I'm always amazed at how the subtlety of the color catches me off guard in the emotional effect I, it has on me. Because of that, I started to understand more clearly how advertisers use color, why this packaging that I've uh, started to work with is so seductive and so fabulous and so crazy because we throw it all away. So when the Oklahoma City Museum of Art called, we had this great discussion about the possibility of an enormous installation. And after we finished talking, I heard that game show voice, I heard, come on down. It was the strangest thing to just know that's the title, that it is about the enticement that the color is, the really kind of sexiness of packaging and abundance and this thing that is being said that there is an experience to be had. Because everything I'm using has that kind of subtle um, subtext, it was an exciting title to just address it and call it what it is. <laughs>